Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Hollow Knight. What else is there to do aside from continuing on? So we have two options here. I think I'm gonna take this left option right here to go. The reason is because this seems to be the path that leads back to... Well, where we wanna go. Shit. Well, okay. So never mind that. What I'm trying to do here is there is no path forward, at least not yet. So this is the path that seems to oops, lead to uh, the other area, the fungal wastes again. And if there is a chance to get back, I will take it. I am doing terribly. I think I've gotten hit by every single enemy up to this point. It's all good. Yes, I have. Come on. I can avoid one enemy. It's not that difficult. Okay, there will be some... <laughs> Fuck! Okay. So, this is what this episode is gonna be like. This is how we're playing. What the hell? That's how we're playing, game. That, what the hell is... What the hell is that? It's like a weird spider thingy. It's probably not a good idea to be hit by that thing. Hmm. Let's look at the other... Wait, where am I? Oh, okay, I'm down there. Okay, I got confused with the map for a second. So I think if we... Yes, you should be able to do that. You do it right. Precision platforming. I've managed to, like, hang on to it. You need to be, like, very, very specific with how you jump. There might be a seek once break, I don't know. Or it might just lead to some extra treasure. Oh, it really seems like you could do it. Maybe you cannot. It's very possible that you cannot. Whatever, who cares. We can come back here later if we need to. Which I'm probably gonna forget, but never mind that. Okay. Tomb of Giants. This is a little bit too dark. I feel like there was some charm, right? I don't know who had it or I remember why I remember something like that, but I seem to remember there being like a charm or something or some item that gives you light. Or watch this just be the other side of that. Yeah, okay, okay. Okay, never mind. I kind of overthought that. Oh, hey, you're stuck, bitch. I kind of overthought that a little bit. What's the point of that, though, then? It doesn't seem to lead to anything new. Whatever. Eat shit. I've not been using this magic thing, which I should. The fucking Hadouken. Damn, I'm getting surrounded. Enemies on all sides. Enemy at the gates. Okay, I just fell off. Never mind. Anyways, I took a few days break from streaming and recording. Because I was feeling a little bit sick last week. And then with a bit of a cold. I'm okay now. And that's why there were no... Cool. That's why there were no streams last week. Well, actually, I'm recording this on Sunday, but there will be a stream today. So, I guess at this point a stream has already happened, unless something, something drastic has gone wrong. And I mean drastic. Ah. Oh. I panicked. As much of a professional speedrunner as I am, you know. No one can be perfect. That hit, didn't it? Yeah, it did. 
just didn't kill. Would have been disappointed if it didn't hit. So this does lead back, I think. It seems to. What the? What the fuck is that noise? Someone is having a conversation. Conversating. <laughs> I like the speed. You know the way... I'm assuming that's like an MP... Oh shit. I missed my Hadoken. The way the NPCs... I am just doing terribly. The way the NPCs speak in this game reminds me of Rayman. Oh, there he is. He's stuck. It's like fucking Onion Bro, isn't it? This dude. We're constantly having to like rescue him from shitty situations. How the hell am I gonna get to him? Don't worry. Dude whose name I forgot. I am not leaving you. Unless you need some item to get to him. Because if so, then I am leaving him. This is a weird spider thing. But only temporarily will I leave him. I wonder if any of these NPCs will ever help you. Okay, there he is. Oh wait, this is not it? He is extremely pissed. I'll take a look around. Okay, I floated. I floated myself into the other enemy. So even though I'm getting hit a lot, like I, I'm not getting close to actually dying. I mean, I do have that item that boosts the amount of whatever, like energy I get from all my actions. Fucking hell, this place is a maze. Which is good. Okay, this will be... Naisu. Oh, fuck, there's so many pads. Just thinking about it. I kind of like it. I mean, this game feels... way more maze-like than any of the Souls games. Oh, hello. Are you okay? I uh, know shame in backing out. Can't all be as badass as I am. Oh shit, that's a sewer. Yeah, how about we don't go in there just yet? There seems to be like a train station or whatever nearby. Or a resting place. Yeah, this is a dead end. And that's how it links back. Cool. Well, it's nice that we have a resting place. And yeah, we are back here. So, I gotta figure out how to rescue our little buddy. Because he's tangled up in there and he's all pissed. So, let's not leave him. Let's not be an asshole. I'll take a look around and see what we can do. Oh, they burst out of... Oh, that's kind of gross. They burst out of... Shit, I'm doing terribly. Oh, there's still one... Ugh. Fuck. Oh, there's so many. There's so many. Can't reach me. Uh, yes, you can reach me. Eat shit. That's how you make it through. But this is the way I came. Because I don't seem to remember any of these enemies. Unless they just like... Oh, fuck off. 
Unless they just like wake up like this. Hello? King's Idol. Yeah, I'll heal myself. Why not? Or is it like they die and eventually it like bursts out of them? Oh, fuck. So what if... Now this can't be it. This can't be the way to go. That was a wonderful killed a bit of platforming okay so he's stuck here above us and we can go like this way ish oh okay this thing is hilarious <laughs> Zod the Mighty. I'm not gonna remember his name. Okay, he's pissed. Boomer. Okay. So I'll leave the boomer alone. Uh, and we'll get back to what I wanted to do. What I wanted to do is explore the other tunnel. By other tunnel, I mean the thing that leads back. Okay, that's not gonna work. Fuck th these areas are okay. No, I don't. I didn't want to talk to you. These areas are pretty intricate. The boy be getting lost, and it's like my terrible navigational skills are getting exposed. How am I getting... I'm literally getting hit by every single enemy. That's probably a waste because... There is a what you call it. A resting place nearby. Yeah, this is what we wanted to check. How we... Or what part of the fungal wastes... This leads back to... I saw him there, and they keep running away, you bitches. That was... how, how the hell did I not get hit there? Stop running away! I need to kill you, because I need healing powers. We're getting close. There is another side. But with no point. Man, I need... Oh, they can just like float across. Good for them. So again, like what I was saying is I seem to remember a charm that is supposed to give you light but I don't know what's even worse is even if I knew where the hell that thing was well, actually, I would pick it up. I'm not that cheap. I cannot believe that they can like make it across like that. I'm kind of going half off of instinct in this place. Holy shit, there's more. Oh, it knocked me. 
something that can happen. Classic platformer thing. When you no, you get knocked across. Oh shit. You get knocked back across into the previous area. Usually not a good thing. So it actually looks like you cannot get out here. Because you cannot jump any further. So probably... Probably this is here for a reason. This part. Of the area. Shit, don't go back. That's cheap. Okay. And it knocked me back across. Fuck. <sighs> this feels like the blight town of this game. And then it's an annoying area. Although, to be fair, I'm playing kind of like an asshole too. But... It has that feeling, you know. Where it's like... Kind of half-purposely built to be incredibly annoying. Which I'm okay with, you know. I'm not gonna bitch about that too much. Wanna make your area annoying? By all means, go ahead. Okay, this... Yeah, you do have to go this way. To go forward. all terrain oh I just figured out what this place reminds me of the fucking second world of demon souls the mines you know what it's called I, I don't know what it's called but world 2 that's what this place reminds me of even with these like worm enemies and the giant worms that are basically indestructible we got them themes, you know. Oh, shit, spawn right on top of me. Yeah. Oh. That's annoying. When they spawn on you. Usually it's always when I'm trying to heal too. Uh, okay. We're definitely on the other side of something. Get all that cash, thank you. Well, that was quite a sentence. We're definitely on the other side of something. I just realized how little sense. What are the chances that this is a boss? I think... There is a chance. Oh, fuck. Oh, you've got to be... What a... Oh, what a dick move. Yeah, I'm going to ignore these enemies now. We're speed running up to the top. Damn, that was quite a trick. GG's game. This game does this a lot. Actually. I was really hoping that was going to break and that wasn't like uh, something else you need. Where... Are we? Oh, I think I kind of know where we are. Yeah. Should I just bite the bullet? This is... But see, if it's a boss, then it's gonna be an asshole boss because... It is a boss. It's not. Is this a fucking cult or something? Uh, 
Uh, Moss Prophet. This feels like a cult. Great. Moss Prophet. Glad to meet you. Uh, where the hell do I go from here? I mean, obviously, down back into the deep nest or whatever it's called. I don't think we have any other choice. Yeah, we probably don't. You know, it still looks like there are multiple paths that I've yet to explore. The failed tramway. Wait, where is that? I don't remember hitting that. Oh, that's where... Okay. Fuck, I hate these enemies. Yeah, these enemies are really annoying. The spawn out of the ground on top of you type. There's so many of... Th Holy shit. That actually puts us closer to the goal that I wanted to go to. Dying here, but... We need to get our little thingy. Man, those are annoying enemies. It's the spawn on top of you thing that's really irritating. Fuck, it's far away too. My corpse. Oh, okay. That was an interesting bit of platforming. It's all good, though. We'll make it up here. Exactly. Oops. Should be easy enough. Oh, thank you for being so close. Why did it... I guess it only shows the general area. Or, like, what region it's in. Not, like, the... Exact location. As I'm about to die again. Is this where I meant to go? It's not. This is where we're meant to go. I'll look at that tramway. Failed tramway station or whatever. But before that... I'm not stupid. And then of course there's a whole other direction that I didn't go in. Oh, fuck. I did not mean to do that. I wonder if this resets. Oh, shit. Enemy HP. Why do I keep missing like an idiot? Thank fuck for that. Please tell me that's not like the main... Is that... Okay, no, those are background spikes. It's not easy to tell sometimes. Yeah, that's what I wanted. So I really gotta go at that one first, the spawner. This, this area is really cool, actually. I like the atmosphere of it. The design. And the way shit interconnects in this game is absolutely crazy. It's 
guess, uh, some of the most intricate areas. Okay, I'm about to die. I'm dead. To be honest, I didn't do that as carefully as I should have. I will be fully willing to admit that. So where were we? Okay, I'm timing that terribly. The thing is, it doesn't stop spawning them either. So it's like... You're bound to get overwhelmed if you're not careful. Please don't die, please don't die. Mainly because of my cash. Which I gotta go and get. Alright, so up here, and then we went down here, not down here, we went down here. So it's here somewhere, my corpse, and we're gonna, we're gonna go, we're gonna go, just for a little bit. Yeah, okay. Don't die. Don't die. Heal. Why does everything have to be so close? Oh, okay. So this just loops around like this. That's nice. Giving you easy access. And all these areas feel so Metroid-ish. You know, these like abandoned type. Especially Metroid Prime does these like abandoned, you know, stations, locations and all that. You know, the classic example, the crashed pirate ship, which is actually one of my favorite areas in that game. It's got that atmosphere. That's what this feels like. Wish it wasn't full of these enemies, but hey. What can you do? They give a lot of cash, though. Somehow I'm close to death again. I'm being a little bit tactical here, or trying to be. Not to always spend all my power. Tram pass. Oh, you know what that means. There was a tram area. And you know what, I bet you that this is the only thing here. There's a tram somewhere, unless you can also use it on this one. No, this one is in the background. What the hell would you do with it anyways? Cool. So I have some ideas of what to do with this. I'm assuming I'm right. You're hearing the music, the music is absolutely crazy. If we go to the whole map, which... 
There it is. Isn't that a tram pass? I think it is. The Queen Station as well. I don't know if there was something like there, like that there. No, don't. Oh, okay, that was nearly very stupid. Luckily, only nearly. And of course, there's also a whole other area going down here. Oh, this is one of those extremely dark. Let's not touch that just yet. I feel like I feel like that's one of those areas that you need some item, specifically some light to make it through. All right then. I would say that this was a fairly successful quest. A journey into this place. Again, we have of course the whole other path going to the right. It seems like there's plenty there to do. And now, of course, we can use the tram pass for something. I think I'll go down, check the right path first, and then we can go to other places. All right, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Hollow Knight, and I'll see all of you next time. Peace out and goodbye.